When price is less than average total cost, the firm is earning negative profits, or the firm is earning a loss. Now over the long run, we'd expect a firm with consistent losses to quit being a firm, to exit the industry. Now when price is equal to average cost, profits are zero. Now remember these are economic profits, and economic profits of zero are normal profits. This firm is probably earning positive accounting profit and covering all of their opportunity cost. When price exceeds average total cost, this firm is going to earn positive profits, and in the long run we'd expect other firms to want to enter this industry. Now, when price and average total cost are equal, the firm is breaking even. We can call this the break-even price. So on the right, we have the graph that we've previously seen with the shutdown price at the minimum of the AVC. The break-even price is going to happen at the minimum of the ATC. Now, in the long run, firms will exit the industry if they're earning any losses. So the long-run supply curve is going to start at the minimum of the ATC, not the minimum of the AVC, right? Our short run supply curve starts at the minimum of the AVC, long run ATC.